Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sharnies and welcome to Simply Unique Web. Today, this week, is just like a book review week where I'm going to tell you about another sports romance book today. I really, really love this book. If you didn't see my other video this week on Tuesday, you can go to my channel and check that out. It's a book by Kendall Ryan called The Rebound. So really good. But today, I need to talk to you guys about this book that you see on the thumbnail. So, if you haven't already, go down below if you're new, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and everyone give me a like on this video sometimes throughout this video. But let's get started with this video. Today's book review video is going to be over a book called Austin's Revenge by Jax McKay. Austin's Revenge is book two within this series. The series is called Aries, Aries Falls Billionaire Series. And this is like book two because it was like a prequel before this one. Like I said in the beginning, this is more like a office sports romance type of book because a lot of the romance was in the office. <laughs> so just to give you a list of the books because there's going to be five total within the series and all of them are coming out this year. So that's really really awesome because you're gonna be addicted reading this book so book one is the prequel called the awakening which is out now to begin the story line of this character austin but each book is a standalone novel the second book is austin's revenge that i'm gonna talk to you guys more about today then the third book is jay's redemption and the fourth book is asher's downfall and then the last and final book is called cash's match Ooh, i forgot to tell you so jay's redemption comes out october 7th Asher's downfall comes out october 28th and then cash's match comes out november 18th so yes so we're gonna get all of them right this year so that's really great so within Austin's Revenge that I'm going to talk to you guys about today there is five main characters so that's obviously the main guy character within this book his name is Austin and then the main girl character within this book her name is Violet then there's three friends of Austin so Jay, Cash, and Asher so what is this book about well let me tell you so this Austin he was a MMA fighter but he got injured. Really bad that he had to retire. But then he had a really awesome, great night, one night stand with an awesome, great girl named Violet. They had their night, beautiful night, but they went their separate ways because nobody wanted a relationship. Years later, Austin is making an MMA promo, like promotion company for fighters since he was in the business and he's passionate about that. But starting the company is always hectic and they needed an assistant. And the assistant that Jay has hired the is the one and only Violet. Now with that came with issues because Violet has brought a lot of lot of lot of baggage within their whole little group there. And it's just a lot of twists and turns and some jabs and backstabbing. Now I would totally, totally recommend you guys to read this book because like I said, Violet has a lot of issues and a lot of her issues comes with a lot of like danger it's just a lot of things gonna go on and you don't want to miss out on all the craziness and the danger that she has to go through but the next thing the villain in this book his name is nate which he is pretty crazy as a person and it causes trouble for violet and austin and you can't i can't believe what i read about what nate does but uh yeah he, he's a he's problem problem indeed as i was reading and fully finished this book I found a more deeper meaning within the story. So what I felt the deeper meaning within this book give to us readers is that you don't want to let people take advantage of you and always speak up and ask for help if you need it. That's like, I feel like that's like the big picture, the big deeper meaning within this book that deals with all of this. So some other little things that you guys should know about this book. It is 21 chapters with an epilogue. And the Kindle version has about 261 pages, if that matters to you, because you know, I like a thick book. So anyways, and the Kindle version is $3.99 compared to the physical version, which is $15.99. But sometimes I always like the physical book. I love the smell of books, new book smell, love it. This book is in Austin's and Violet's point of view. I love that. Like I always say, get the full picture, get the full emotion, get to every aspect of the story. Great. I love that. And also, as I said in the beginning, if you didn't catch it, did you catch it? 
this book is a standalone novel just like all the rest is going to be. So we get the beginning, middle, and end of Violet and Austin's story. And of course there might be in the, the other books as well, duh. But there's no need for a cliffhanger and wondering what will happen next in the next book with them. So all in all, Austin's Revenge is a spicy sports office romance style book with some amazing twists and shocking moments like shocking indeed. I love all the characters within this series already and especially Austin and Violet. They're just so good and I just love them really really a lot and Austin and Violet has the amazing chemistry and the amazing connection that makes the book so spicy and so very intriguing to read. This book is very addicting from beginning to end. They will just keep you glued to each page and each word of the, each chapter. I'm so grateful that I got a chance to read Austin's Revenge early so I can give this book review out for you guys when it comes out because it comes out today. Did I tell you that? It comes out today, guys. It's definitely a book you don't want to miss out on reading. It's, it's that good. I just love these type of books as well. So, yeah. That is Austin's Revenge. So how about right now, go ahead and purchase Austin's Revenge if this sounds good. Or go and deep dive more and check this book out and see if you like it yourself. But other than that, thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll catch you back next week with another cool one. Bye. Hello.